This Group 2 final at the Pine Belt Arena in Tons River starts at 132 pounds and it's Lou Ramo of Hanover Park with the back points as he would go on to post a 9-2 decision over Connor Mills and the Hornets have a 3-0 lead over Delaware Valley. The move to 138 pounds and it's Matthew Colonia of Delaware Valley with the Tech fall 19-3 and 437 over Marco Zecca and the Terriers are up 5-3. At 145 pounds, watch Sean Connolly of Hanover Park get the takedown with 20 seconds to go in the third period as he would post a 2-1 decision over Rise Zikic and the Hornets are up 6-5. Chase Ballberger of Delaware Valley at 152 pounds gets the escape here in the second period during his 4-2 decision over Nick Zara and the Terriers retake the lead 8-6 over the Hornets. They move to 160 pounds and watch Matthew Liberato of Hanover Park build a 9-1 lead as he would major Tanner McLaughlin 11-2, and it's 11-8 Hanover Park. At 170 pounds, it's Sean Lezig of Delaware Valley with the takedown here, as he would post a 17-4 major decision over Sebastian Basilino, and the Terriers are up 12-10. And a good one at 182 pounds, we go to the first tiebreaker tied at one, but Rory DeLuca gets the escape here to take a 2-1 lead over Sean Ramsby. And then DeLuca is able to ride out Ransby to pull out the victory for Hanover Park. And it's 13-12 Hornets midway through the match. The Delaware Valley answers at 195 pounds. Watch Eli Calfanian come through with a full in 48 seconds over Pasquale Di Maiello. And the Terriers have an 18-13 advantage. And Kyle Leitner follows that full with a pin of his own at 220 pounds. As he decks Daniel Jimenez in one minute flat. And it's 24-13 Delaware Valley. At 285 pounds, Giancarlo Delano of Hanover Park ties the match at one with this escape, but he would fall to Josh DeLuca on a stall point, two to one, and it's 27-13 DelVal. Hanover Park gets a much needed win at 106 pounds. It's Jake Paris picking up the escape en route to a one nothing decision over Dylan Uderman, and Hanover Park trails 27-16. And Hanover Park star Don DeFrancesco Antonio Comes through with a fall in 30 seconds here at 113 pounds over Tony Schiller. And when the Hornets are down 27-22 with two matches to go. But Del Val clinches the match here at 120 and the state title as Michael Rubin tops A.J. DeRosa 3-0 to make it 30-22 as Del Val would forfeit at 126 as it would post a 30-28 victory over the Hornets who had another terrific season. Caldwell was a tough team, you know, it was coming close towards the end there. I was, you know, group two's a, a tough group. There was a bunch of good teams in our group and in our section.